Hey guys, thanks for visiting Richard's Corner. Richard here with another haul, this time for my friends over at the Goodwill here in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. Now if you haven't already, please hit like, please hit subscribe, and stay in touch with me so you know what is new and happening here on the channel. And I hope you guys enjoy this haul along many others that I've been sharing on my channel. The idea here is that I try to find all of my favorite toys, books, movies, video games, and more through thrift stores and other thrifty means so that I can save some money on buying said items. And I'm a big fan of buying superhero movies and comics and all kinds of stuff and if I can pay less than retail yeah that's good for me <laughs> so from my friends at Goodwill they actually had a sale uh, pay 80% off of anything with a blue label really exciting except that none of these items had a blue label <laughs> so <laughs> I did luck out though because some of the ones that I found like these these ones didn't have any blue labels on them but they were good keepers nonetheless so I thought I would share that with you starting with this awesome Rocket Raccoon and Groot book now this is actually a kids Marvel book the art is a little bit more um, it's oriented towards a younger audience so it's not as heavy a story but it is a full comic book inside of here in a paperback comic book form um, this, uh, I'm not sure if it, it's, look at that, original price was $13. Holy smokes, I didn't even notice that. Taxes included, 13 bucks. Wow. Okay. Um, so yeah, this, it just sort of shows the story between, uh, Groot and Rocket Raccoon and the, and the unique relationship that they have on the Guardians team. So being, you know, big into the Marvel Universe right now and, and them ending the, um, this, uh, phase of it with Endgame, uh, it's really cool to sort of see, uh, Marvel-related, uh, paperback uh, comics available at thrift stores. Uh, this is obviously an older one though. This was way back from Well, let's see here collecting material from free comic book day 2014 rocket raccoon uh, number one and number five as well as uh, Guardians of the Galaxy one and two and five and Groot number two So this actually has quite a few comics in it, but I can't read what year it's from uh, 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 2016 <laughs> so about 2016 so this only cost me um, 50 cents, 50 cents, because it was a, it's a paperback book and all the paperback books cost 50 cents at Goodwill. Compared to $13 cover price, yeah, 50 cents, I'm walking out super ahead. Now all these movies, they cost $2.50 each and I thought that they were good finds. Unique in cast and character and uh, made me sort of think, yeah, I think I'll give that a view. My Blueberry Nights, this stars Nora Jones, Jude Law, uh, David Strathnam, um, Stratham, pardon me, Rachel Weiss and Natalie Portman. So all of these characters working together in one movie sounds like a really good collaboration of actors and actresses. So I thought it'd be kind of neat. It's, it's kind of a dramatic film. Uh, it's from the Cannes uh, Film Festival. So I thought, okay, something more independent, less Hollywood. I thought it would make a good viewing. I haven't seen a good movie like that in a while. And this particular cast sort of intrigues me. So I thought it would be really good. So My Blueberry Nights, 250 from Goodwill. Of course, uh, no haul is complete on Richard's Corner without something superhero related, including this awesome Adventures of Batman and Robin uh, animated double feature with Poison Ivy and the Penguin. Basically four episodes from this uh, animated series. Now what really makes me excited about this one is because I used to play the uh, an Adventures of Batman and Robin on Super Nintendo and Genesis, uh, like back in the 8-bit or 16-bit days. Um, and it was a really good engaging game. And then when there was a cartoon to go along with it or a cartoon to go along with the game or, or vice versa, uh, it's, you know, the, the characters were really true on the screen to what they were in the animated feature. So I'm really happy to see this particular series on DVD. Uh, I don't have any of these ones yet. So a double feature again with Poison Ivy and Penguin 250 from Goodwill. And the last one, Adam West, classic Batman. This is the Batman movie uh, based on the original TV series. They did make a feature full, uh, feature length movie and this is basically one long cheesy Batman episode. <laughs> so I'm really excited about finding that. Um, the holy, uh, holy special edition Batman edition. <laughs> So this is a really awesome find. I think this is definitely my keeper. It's definitely tongue-in-cheek kind of thing. It's not meant to be taken really seriously. It was very entertaining back in the day to watch it after school with the with a pow and kapak and all those bam, you know, kind of splashes, you know, comic book splashes on the screen. So it was a good series and watching the, the full-length movie will, should be kind of funny to watch. So again, all for all of those movies, 250 from my friends at Goodwill here in Winnipeg. 
So that ends the haul. What's your favorite piece here, guys? Did you think the Groot book, Groot Raccoon book is good? Or do you think it's the Cannes Film Festival movie? Or do you think it's one of the Batman movies that would have been the keeper today? For me, I have to say it's kind of a, 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 a four-way tie here, although this is probably one of my big chases today because Adam West as Batman, you know, it, you have to have a, you have to be in the mood for it because there's such, it's such an edgier movie now, but uh, it's, it's fun to watch. So check it out. Check out your favorite thrift stores. I hope that your thrifty friends are going to be equally awesome and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, if you haven't already, please hit like and subscribe. I hope you guys stay in touch with me here. Check out the haul reveal uh, playlist on the side here and I hope you guys enjoy your stay. Please stay tuned for more. We've got one more haul that I'm going to reveal uh, in this whole series, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Again, it's Richard from Richard's Corner signing off for now. We'll see you next time. Thanks again for tuning in today, guys.